I, uh, I was uh, recently one of the parents chaperoning a field trip for my daughter's kindergarten class. But uh, at a certain point, they were like doing some like arts and crafts or something. This was out on a farm, and uh, and I noticed that uh, you know JJ was trying to take get to the front where she could hear the counselor lady explain what was going to happen. And one of the little boys uh, shoved her because uh, she kind of came up next to him, and he just turns and goes boom, and then she turns around and like shoves him back and nobody sees this but me and shoves him back and then and then he's like about to you know picks it yeah it's about to escalate and so i just kind of grab his arm and i just kind of move him over here i wanted to do more uh, and i diffused it very quickly before anybody really even saw it um and then because i did that he kind of got upset and went over to his mom who happened to be there as well didn't say anything, was just like upset. And mom was like, what's wrong, what's wrong? And he was just like, no. <laughs> so I was like, a oh, little punk. Uh, and that wasn't necessarily the fail. The fail came later. We were going over to the uh, goat inn, and these goats had horns. And it said very clearly on the, on the gate to stay back from the fence, because the horns can get through and can get you. Um, get you. So I walk, I walk a few of them over there to supervise, and here comes a little buddy. Why don't you go see if one can come over to you? And one started to to kind of motor over to him, and he was right against the fence, and I was literally just holding the other like four kids back. And I'm like, I'm like, Shh. just let it happen. I will say though that before the goat got too close, I reached over and I grabbed the back. Push him. <laughs> I grabbed the back of his collar, pulled him back, and I was like, no, 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 let's go. Come on back.